you. This is for all you ladies out there who like a bargain. And this is called buy one, get one, free girls. Hello, I'm Charlie and welcome to another episode of the Time Traveller Diaries. Now today we're going to be visiting the filming locations which were used in series one of the TV drama Baptiste. Baptiste was first broadcast on BBC One in 2019. It's a spin-off series of the TV drama The Missing and it stars Chieki Cario as Julian Baptiste, uh, Tom Hollander as Edward Stratton and Jessica Rain as Genevieve Taylor. Now you can currently view Baptiste Series 1 on Amazon Prime. So without further ado, let's get to the locations. Now this is the very windy Deal Beach in Deal, Kent, England. Now if you look behind me, you can see Deal Pier. We're gonna start off with some rather basic shots from Baptiste, in which you see a dog walker walking along this beach with the pier behind me. As he's walking along, he encounters Tom Hollander, who plays Edward Stratton, getting out of a fishing boat, which is around in this area over here. Now the pair in this scene are strangers. They don't know each other. They briefly kind of greet each other and they both go upon their separate ways. We then see a shot of actor Tom Hollander walking up here and notice this block of buildings here and the region in the background. Now I'm on Dill Seafront and I'm looking at the different fishing boats and I'm pretty sure this was the one that was used in Baptiste. It's got those strange little kind of triangular sort of windows at the bottom and looks pretty much identical. This boat is called the Gary Ann. I don't know if you can see that there. That's got to be the boat, even the back rails, everything looks exactly the same. Now this is Kingsdown Beach in Kingsdown, Kent, England. And the next scene we see in Baptiste is actor Nicholas Woodson who plays Peter. He's walking along the shingle here and he spies a rare shell down on the shingle and he goes down to pick it up. Now upon examining it, he's so impressed with it that he takes it back to his house for further examination, which is where we're going to go next. And then in this next shot we see actor Nicholas Woodson walking towards his house with the seashell that he wants to examine. Notice in the background you can see Kingsdown Cliffs, you can also see that white weather vane pole and also the beach huts. When he gets round to his house he encounters a strange man lurking around there who's Romanian and claims to be there to check the gas meter. Now this house behind me was the house that belonged to, to the character Peter, played by Nicholas Woodson. Now he allows in the man who claims to be from the gas board. He allows him in and he begins to examine with a magnifying glass his seashell that he found a bit more closely. This is when the man suffocates him with a plastic bag and appears to dismember him with a chainsaw. The man turns out to be an assassin named Constantine, who is played by actor, I'll try and get this right, Alec Sekanu. Now, if you notice the actor, Nicholas Woodson, you may have seen him in some other things, including films such as Conspiracy and the James Bond film, Skyfall. Now, this is a weird coincidence. There's a filming crew right up here as we're making our video. Could they be filming Baptiste, I wonder? We keep having these weird coincidences during our time traveler diaries. Well, I just thought I'd mention that. Now this is Kingsdown Cliffs, you can see the cliffs behind me and I'll put a shot up on the screen in which you can see Chequi Cario and Tom Hollander conversing. Notice this navigation beacon in the sea here. Now if you look in the shot that was actually up on the shingle, notice how different the tide is. You can also see a kind of triangular point upon that flat harbour area in the background. We should also mention that Chequi Cario has starred in many films, including Nostradamus, in which he played Nostradamus, Bad Boys alongside Will Smith, and The Patriot alongside Mel Gibson. And Tom Hollander can be seen in films such as Pirates of the Caribbean and Bohemian Rhapsody. This is pretty much the ending shot of the whole of the series, and the camera pans out in which you see the shot of the cliffs 
and that navigation beacon near to where they were standing. Well that brings us to the end of this episode, thanks for watching, please check out our other videos, you might enjoy them, subscribe to our channel on YouTube and like our Facebook page and we'll see you next time on the Time Traveller Diary.